The IBM 650 was the first computer in New Zealand when it arrived in 1961. It had a magnetic drum storage, an arithmetical device using vacuum tubes, and an operator's console. High tech stuff, I know. This week from Azure World. New Kiwi Azure region, a new premium tier for Azure Data Lake storage. Mm, premium. And Azure takes another step towards purging TLS version 1.0 and 1.1. This is Azure This Week, a show currently published in all 58 Azure regions. New Zealand has pretty good internet connection overall, and they are certainly equipped with more bits than here in Australia. In fact, New Zealand's average broadband speed is more than double that of Australia. But Australia has Azure data centers, which obviously makes us more important until now. Yeah, because this week, Microsoft announced they intend to build a new Azure data center and region in New Zealand which will open early 2021. The data center, not the country, that is. Yeah. This new region will bring the Microsoft Cloud into the backyard of their 2,300 partners in the country. So welcome to the big cloud league, Kiwis. Azure Data Lake Storage is a massively scalable, secure data lake functionality built on Azure Blob Storage. It is designed to hold huge data sets for machine learning models and Hadoop compatible file systems in general. Now we're talking 100 terabytes plus in size and often exceeding a petabyte. That's a lot of data. Well, now there is a new premium tier for all that data. This new performance tier complements the existing hot, cool and archive tiers. Premium tier offers a significantly lower storage latencies as compared to other tiers and cost savings for workloads that are transaction heavy. In other words, cover more cache and you can read and write your data faster. TLS is short for Transport Layer Security and is the protocol which protects data sent to and from over the internets. The old standards of TLS are versions 1.0 and 1.1, which are slowly being phased out. Version 1.2 is where the cool kids are at these days, and that includes everything on Azure. Hence, it is no surprise that Azure File Sync is removing support for 1.0 and 1.1 from August 2020. So make sure you update your Azure connected service to TLS 1.2. If you want to know more about secure internet traffic, check out the Azure Fireside chat that I had with Scott Helm. The link is in the description. I think that is quite enough about New Zealand in a single episode of the show. So next week, Microsoft Build is on. It will be a free 100% online event, so get amongst it. Drink that free cloud training juice. Mm. As we say on the A Cloud Guru team, when there are more regions of cloud goodness than we know what to do with, seek and you show cloud. So see you next week and keep staying calm, Kiwi Gurus.